Afternoon, everybody. Welcome to uh, Our Favorite Things. Um, we come in today, we're going to talk about uh, magazine holsters. Something that everyone should have a spare magazine, so there's lots of options. Our, our favorite, the one that we use every day, I, I carry a spare magazine every day, 15 rounder. And the magazine pouch that we use is this one by Pitbull. Um, you can see the our names on there because we hand them out and it helps helps uh, at the end of our class helps our students find their way back to their owners <laughs> but this the reason why we like it is it has uh, a lot of flexibility to it you can take like a single stack magazine and you can use that uh, as a magazine holder and it works for single stack or you can use a big old double stack one and it'll hold it as well. And the reason why it works that way is because these are rubber here and they expand out and squeeze against the magazine so it stays in. Uh, so you get the flexibility of, uh, you know, whatever kind of magazine you have, it'll accommodate. So <clears throat> that's the reason why we like the that. And I only care one spare magazine. I figure, you know, 28 rounds is probably enough. So, um, yeah, that's one particular option. Some others uh, that are out there that we use in our classes, Carla's gonna show you. This one here is a single stack. This is a custom single stack. It's molded to a single stack magazine. Um, it just has a metal clip to go over your waistband. You could do it inside the waistband or outside. Really, it's thin enough, it wouldn't matter. But this one we had custom done for the shield. So they fit in there perfectly, holds them in place. You know where it is when you need it. Um, the one thing on this one, though, that it's really not designed to wear uh, as an outside the waistband because after a day of wearing that against your body, that hurts. You flip it around and put this part against your body uh, inside the waistband, and it's it's a lot more comfortable. Uh, although this, it's just the Kydex. Yeah. yeah, it's just Kydex, but it's not the most comfortable, but it's a lot more comfortable than that edge right there being against your body for even an hour or two. It starts to hurt. I know because I tried it, so. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> there's another one. The, now, we bought these, like a 12 of them. Yeah, a I think couple of packs. Two, two, two six packs, so we got, you know, Baker's Dozen. And, and the reason why we did these is because we had people showing up to class and they needed to borrow something. And it has a similar type thing going on. If you put that against your body all day, uh, it's gonna hurt. Now, it doesn't stand out as far as that other one, so it's not quite as bad, but it's still not real comfortable. What is comfortable is this side. So if you wear it inside your waistband and click that over your belt, uh, these things are designed to be able to you know, hold a large magazine and off you, off you go, but put a smaller magazine in there and well, it can get buried down in there. So, and kind of hard to get out. So, some people don't use a magazine pouch. They use their pocket. And if you've got it in your pocket, it's gonna be like hard to get to and your emergency reload is gonna be slow. So, yeah. <clears throat> and then, you know, there's these other ones out there like Carl and I both have five, the full size original XDM when they first came out. Um, we bought them and, and when it was gun of the year. And we love both of them. She has one in nine and I have one in 45. This is my one for 45. And it come, it, it, the whole kit came with the holster, uh, three mags, a load assist thing, and this, this mag carrier, right? It's almost as big as my hand. The only time I wear this is if I have an IDPA vest on and I'm shooting an event or maybe a, a bowling pin match or something. This is definitely not something that it would be easy to hide. It sticks out too far. Unless you're wearing a winter coat or something, uh, then I suppose it'd probably work. But I don't conceal this particular gun. So uh, and it's got Picatinny rails on it right there. I don't know, what, what is that for? I don't even know, I can't imagine. If you know, comment in the in the section below. Tell me why I have Picatinny rails on my mag pouch there. I don't know. Anyway, um, 
spare spare red dot maybe I don't know <laughs> <laughs> so this one here this is high speed gear uh, high speed gear comes uh, with a new solution for uh, well I, I don't know that it's new they've been around a while but something that is somewhat new to people that carry is using a 5.7 right yeah. 5.7 is a new it's not a new cartridge but a couple a of new longer cartridge than what normal wear and carry concealed carry uh, magazines would be so the magazines won't fit in our standard right so they're, they're longer the cartridges are longer so a lot of the like this pit bull is great and it expands so you can get double wide, uh, you know double stacks and single stacks in it but it doesn't expand in this direction to accommodate the five seven round but this does this one expands in both directions this you know width and length length yeah cartridge length thanks perfect <laughs> so and it's a double it's a double uh, magazine pouch so you can put two in this one um, and it comes with this strap to where you could run your belt through here or you could strap it to your vest if you're you got a vest on or something so um, high speed gear is another solution um, there's a whole bunch of options out there on um, nothing's right nothing's wrong it's all about what works for you and for us uh, that pit bull is the bomb and you know John and Bo John and Bonnie are the ones that turned us on to these yeah. remember yeah. so uh pays to have friends who've tried things first yeah <laughs> so we've been using them for years he showed up uh I think it was for our CCW instructor course that he probably showed up with it and so when I was teaching the instructor course so all right uh that's it um tell us what your favorite magazine holster is and uh Maybe comment we'll get one check it out ourselves comment in the section in the comment section below and remember safety, safety first, first safety, safety last, last safety, safety always, always.